work. So after studying the layout of the publication, you can see some scroll button I forgot to indicate here. This one is called vertical scroll bar and this one is called horizontal scroll bar. So you can scroll on your document left or right or vertically up and down. Again, we also have uh, rulers here. So we have horizontal ruler and vertical ruler. These ones are very helpful for your design, making sure that you're putting things in the light places and uh, yeah, just for your guideline. So I'm gonna start our publication here. So basically what I normally do, I normally make, uh, first, first thing I do, I just create a text box. So I'm gonna come here and start tab under text ribbon i'm gonna click draw text box and you can see our handle right there it has changed to plus so i'm gonna just click from from the corner there click hold the left button of my mouse and drag diagonally so that i'll be able to draw that beautiful rectangle there then i'm gonna release it so it will create a text box like that and I can be able now to format this text box. Text box formatting means making something appealing, putting some beautiful design, ensuring that the one who will be able to receive this, this certificate or publication will uh, be able to enjoy it. So I'm gonna right click here on my mouse, just like that, okay. Let me do that again. So I'm gonna put my mouse there, right click, okay, again, and then I'm gonna enjoy this menu here, I'm gonna come down, there's a lot of options here, I'm gonna choose format text box, and here I can put a border, so there's a lot here on these tabs, on the format text box I can put some colors and lines, Maybe change the size of the text box, which I am not intending to. The layout, text box, and alternate text. So I'm gonna come here to the first tab here. I'm gonna assume fill. Fill is the background color, so you can see our text box will be here right now. But I don't want that. It's a format for more for more documents, so I'm gonna say no fill there. I'm gonna come here down here and choose border art. So border art. There are small pictures here we can I can be able to, to choose from and be able to make my borders uh, beautiful. So I'm gonna choose one here, maybe that one, and then click OK. I can also change the color. So I can come here and say my color, I don't want that black and white. I just want this beautiful color here, red, OK? Maybe red is my favorite color, I don't know. So I'm gonna choose it here. You can also make some options. Maybe you don't want red, you want blue. You can choose that, okay? So I'm gonna click okay. And uh, boom, we have a beautiful border there. So it's nice there, right, right there. So some people don't like these borders. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna choose another option. So I'm gonna come to insert, come to borders and accents. Here there are beautiful frames and bars. So say uh, there's some bars here, some emphasis, some frames. So for my publication, let me start with that one of bars. So let me choose one bar here, click it there, come here on top, place it right there, and I'm gonna drag and ensure that it fits to the width of my or, or the length of my my publication right there so that's that's a bar you can put it there always ensure that everything you put is within this blue outline here so that when you print your publisher uh, publication or your certificate or your you um, whatever you are making will not uh, have some overflow so i'm gonna copy this so I'm gonna hold my control key there, click and drag. So it will copy that and I'm gonna move it now and place it nicely there. Okay, I'm gonna go back here, choose the same bar. This time around I'm gonna rotate it 
90 degrees drag it and put it here at the corner I'm gonna also resize it like that and there we go beautiful so I'm gonna resize it like this there the corners allows you to to resize while this for the handle here it allows you to move your 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 object so I'm gonna resize there make sure it's fitting nicely like that hold my control key and you can just click and hold so it will copy that drag it and right there we have our, our frame now so these ones I normally see them like they are kind of more more official so I'm gonna ensure that it fits nicely in the corners like that so again you can change the format if you don't want that color you can choose a different color here but I don't I normally like changing the kind of schemes I'm using so you can see there are a lot of them here so I'm gonna click this drop down choose one here and you can see the whole frame is changing and let us choose a beautiful one like um, let me see let me see a berry there berries are the sweetest so we have a beautiful frame there and next we are going to insert some more that so make sure you hang around and uh, let's let me see you in the next video